Andrew, what is it like talking playoffs? How how special is that to you? That's a great feeling. Um, having been in the playoffs, you know, obviously since I've been here, so having this opportunity to play at this level um, is a great feeling. I'm looking forward to it. What is it about Philly that is challenging to you? Yeah, I mean, number one um, opponent in, the, in, in our division. Um, they've done a great job. Obviously, their front is really good. I think they have like something like 70 sacks or something like that. So um, definitely a tough opponent, but we're getting prepared for them. What makes Hassan so deadly as a pass rusher? Um, I think he has a good ability to change his rushes. A lot of guys have like one or two go-to moves, but you can tell he studies um, the tackles and he has different go-to moves depending on who it is. Beginning of this year, not a lot was thought of the offensive line as a group. I'm sure you guys heard a lot of that. You played the last few weeks, obviously, terrific. Last weekend was great. What does it feel like now that you've sort of started to prove people wrong? Um, honestly, we don't focus too much on that. It's the same approach, whether we play well or don't play well, is to get better each and every week, um, protect DJ, and open the pose and run again. Does it feel like your offense is clicking? right now is about as well as you guys would want it to be? Yeah, I think, um, you know, this past game we executed pretty well. It starts with, you know, DJ and um, getting the ball to our playmakers. And obviously, if we do our job, you know, we see what they can do. So we just want to do our best to continue that. You've got a few games in Philly, would you say it's probably top three for hostile environments on the road? No, definitely. I mean, their crowd is their, their crowd is brutal. Um, and then it helps when their team is as good as they are. So we're looking forward to it. Um, it's, it's nothing but us against the world, so that's the mentality that we have. How does this team not look at what you've accomplished so far and look ahead to what might lie ahead in the future here? Yeah, in the playoffs, is you, have, you have to have a, a short-term memory. Um, it's 1-0, and um, sudden death, winner, you go home. So we can't focus on what happened. We can't look forward to, to what's you know in the future. Only can focus on, focus on what's right in front of us. Andrew, can you feel any sort of buzz? In, in the city, in the town? I mean, I know you guys are pretty insulated, but can you feel what's going on here? Um, I haven't been out much, but I, I'm sure that, you know, fans are happy um, with what we've done so far, but we're focusing on, you know, getting better and, and being better than we are right now. Could you hear those chants in Minnesota from Giants fans? Yeah, definitely. Um, they, they travel well. Um, it, was, it was a great feeling to be at a away game like that and have that many fans, you know, supporting us. What was it like last week watching Daniel? You know, it's 400 total yards yeah. doing everything. How impressive uh, was that as an offensive lineman to see him do that? Yeah, DJ was amazing. Um, did everything we asked him to do. Uh, when there was nothing open, you know, scramble and made plays for us. Didn't turn over the ball. So when he plays like that, we have a good opportunity to win against anybody. Does Philly, do you expect them to move their guys a lot, or do you expect to see most of the same guy across from you? They do a good job of um, switching it up. Um, so I think. Joshua will be back this game, so I'll probably see him most of the time. And then uh, Brandon Graham rotates a lot more both sides. Yeah. What's allowed Brandon Graham to maintain his level of play for so many years? What does he do that's, that, that makes him so good for so long? That's crazy. It's like he got the founding youth or something. Um, I think this is like one of his best seasons ever. Um, he does a good job. He has really good power, does a good job of switching that up too. Um, you know, bull swim, things like that. Um, great rusher for them. Do you find guys attacking you specifically in a different way than they did a couple of years ago, maybe getting a little more respect from them in certain ways? Yeah, this year I've seen um, a lot of power. Um, don't really get a, a ton of you know inside moves and stuff like that, but a lot of power and, and outside moves. How is that different from maybe they would go after you as a rookie? Yeah, rookie area was because I, I overset a lot, so they would attack me inside a lot more, um, inside counters and stuff like that.